So it's not worth the dragon wall coming up about 100 meters on this gentle slope. Gentle and that slope. is good for the shoulders but it's slow. in the back on hands and feet. Oh, I did this. it here. And then at the top we go down the second harder part, okay. which is the steep slope head first. Okay. Can yeah, I did the. Okay, now we have properly warmed up, we can move on to the intense exercises and this is for the upper body. So first of all, I'm doing an alternation of pull-ups and then dips and repeat them three times. And the idea with each of them is not the repetition of how many you can do, no. For gaining weight, it is short and intense. So maybe no more than seven or eight at a time. So that's what I'll do now. Okay, now we've done the pull-ups and the dips, we move on to the wide-angle incline push-ups. And a new one, a novel one, which you don't normally see, called the back swings. And this is good for the shoulders, the back and the core. So what are we going to do? We're going to swing back as high as we can and coming down both legs, we stop at vertical. It sounds easy, but believe me, it's quite hard. the plank this is the best exercise for the abs and I've developed a four minute routine which you just fulfill and repeat repeat as long as possible if it's more than 15 minutes I would suggest putting some weights on or increasing the, uh, the weight on the shoulders okay let's begin yes. so, Spend one minute in a static position, just getting used to the breathing and the focus on the position of the body. So the plank is so called after a plank of wood which is dead straight and so the body should be dead straight from top to toe. No slouching like this and no arching like this. It must be perfectly straight. Okay. And then the breathing, we breathe through the upper chest and contract the abs, which you cannot see, but it's like a much be, you know. So, focus on that position for one minute. And we have 10 seconds left. And then begins our four minute routine. So, five seconds. 
Right, let's go. Up on hands and one hand in front. Just for 15 seconds. Hold it for 15 seconds. And then the other hand. Only 15 seconds, so it's not too hard. And then one leg. Five seconds and the other leg. And now the opposite leg and diagonally opposite arm. Fifteen seconds. side then what I do is normally relax for 30 seconds before the side plank that's a bit easier 20 seconds And remember, this is at the end of the workout, so I'm already very tired. Five seconds. Okay. Side plank. Down to the elbow. And the other side. Last part, these are the crunches. Here we go. Twenty. Then 20 seconds of rest. After an upper body workout, it's much harder, but the minimum should be five minutes. Three, two, one. Great, good stuff. Thank you for watching.